To illustrate this, a shallow hole, similar to a percolation test hole, is pre-soaked once. Then blue food coloring is added to show where the water tends to flow through the soil. After about an hour of time has elapsed, further excavation reveals that the dye is penetrated downward through the upper subsoil, but not into the hardpan layer of the lower subsoil. Rather, it slowed its downward movement and flowed laterally on top of the hardpan. In soils with dense hardpan subsoils, it is common to find a zone a few inches thick that is saturated with water near the top of the hardpan. Although this thin zone may be saturated, the hardpan layer just beneath it often remains unsaturated. This condition, called a perched water table, is especially common during wetter times of the year. This includes the late fall through the months of spring. In our climate, perched water tables typically disappear in the drier summer months. This thin, saturated zone is a boundary condition that affects septic system leach field designs due to its influence on water and wastewater movement.